Puss in Boots. Okay, I, I, not that I ever thought it was gonna be a bad movie, but these movies are so consistently hysterical and I'm sure like it comes to you, was it like, I don't care what the character is, let me in. I mean, first I was such an, it was an honor to be asked to audition because I didn't get at, like, you know, an offer for it. They were like, we'd like to hear your voice. But then later found out that the director was like, no, we knew we wanted you. We just wanted oh, okay. to see if you were interested or not show our cards. And then I was like, I was just honored to audition with Selma and Antonio because they were such part of the, you know, Shrek universe. And I just couldn't believe it when I got it. I was like, wait, we get to like do work together. And, and it's rarely done. And it's definitely not an animation. It was the first time you have three Latinos as leads. That's not usually the norm. And so it's we've made history just by making uh, an animated film, which is kind of great and amazing. It's a very big deal. Uh, and uh, you are, I mean, would you say you're like friends now? Like is Selma like you text? I would say, and you know what she called me last night? She got into town, she was like, hi Harvey, I'm so tired. Mi perrito, como estas? How are you, my little doggy? And I was like, I'm good. And I was like, Selma Hai just calls me and tells me that yeah. she just got into town, which is really nice and lovely. She's so tired, but she's gonna show up here and like blow everyone away with how Absolutely. stunning she is. Yeah. I mean, you remember, she, she lives in Europe. So like it was a long track. So like the fact that, you know, for her to get here was a whole journey. So yeah. I'm glad that she's gonna be here. Uh, what are you presenting tonight? Can you tell us? Yes, I'm presenting a musical or, or best motion picture comedy. Yeah. Oh boy, that is a tough category. I'm not gonna ask you to pick, so don't worry. But who do you pick? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I can't, I legally cannot say. No, but I'm really excited just to, to, to be presenting that. You know, it's such a huge category and a huge honor. So for us to do that together and with, you know, Puss in Boots itself being also nominated as well, it's a huge thing. I'm really happy to be here. I mean, it would have been maybe better if what we do in the shadows, if they had gotten them in, uh, I mean, lots of love. Look, that show's gotten so much love over the years and, and hopefully a lot more to come. Season five is wrapped and we'll be coming to you uh, very shortly. And I, that's all I'll say because then I'll get into trouble. Oh. Yeah, a lot of things, a lot of things are happening. Is there a, like a word or phrase you would use to describe the theme of the season? Ooh, uh, I'd say for me personally, um, ooh, that's the word that could get me in trouble because it could give a lot and a little at the same time. Um, surprising.